Hey, what's up YouTube? It's Ben Wa Smith and I'm going to be sharing my random workout split with you guys. Most splits are done by the week, but I'm pretty sure that your muscles don't actually know what a week is. They say in general that your muscles are supposed to recover every probably four to five days. If you're young, you know, you recover quicker. So basically, I'm young. So therefore, me doing a th three-way split, I mean, three-day split is pretty much, um, I feel it's inadequate, like I'm really babying myself and I could do more. You know, some people go up to five day splits. As many workouts as you're gonna do might equal almost the same amount as a five day split, but not really. And this is basically what I'm gonna explain to you guys. I'm not even recommending you to do it, but basically I'm gonna work out a muscle group every five days, no matter what day it lands on, whether it's Saturday, Sunday, and I'm, like I said, it's not for everybody, but if you're like me and you're self-employed, then you can find, you know, 40 minutes out of your day to get a workout in. So pretty much, um, for this is how it's going to break down. If you do chest on Monday, then I'm going to do chest on Saturday too. And then it'll like end up being around that next Wednesday. It'll be my chest day. It won't be certain days such as Monday for chest because, um, this is pretty much how I look at it. I basically did some estimating. Say for an example, you do a three-day split like how I've been doing chest day on Monday, which chest triceps um, and shoulders. Wednesday is back and biceps and Friday will be full leg day. Um, if you were doing a split like that, um, within a three-month period, um, I, I actually calculated this from um, April to about July, you're only going to do 13 chest workouts. Only 13. But if you do it every five days, you're going to do 18. To get um, five chest workouts, that would take a whole nother month and probably a week. Because most general months are like four weeks long, depending on if it starts like... A, you know April the 1st is Monday or you know if the second is on a Monday then you'll get five actually in that month but for an example in a three month period you're only going to do ch three, 13 chest workouts in general around 13 um, the way I'm going to do it I'm going to end up getting 18 so that's a whole nother month and some change of chest workouts that I did in a smaller amount of time just by um taking 40 minutes out of my day to go on extra days that I wasn't going to at first. If you add up all the workouts, all my chest workouts, all of my back workouts and all of my leg workouts, and you compare the three months of doing a three day split and the every five day thing that I'm gonna start doing, that's 53 workouts versus 39 workouts. That's a... Um, it's quite a difference. I'm gonna be working out more often. And it's not like a five day split because a five day split would be in general in three months, like 60 workouts, roughly. So I'm gonna be doing 53 workouts, meaning it's close to a five day split, but I'm gonna have more, um, more rest days, basically. And also, um, I'm gonna prevent overtraining by still, by doing D low weeks when I feel is necessary. And also, <clears throat> I just look at it like this. Say you train chest for a whole month. That's only four workouts. Only four workouts. Now imagine by the end of the next month, imagine the strength gain difference from just a month. You know, you could in a month you could put on some some reasonable strength in a month. I'm gonna be working out more often in general. And this is a really random thing, but my life is random and I like being random. And, you know, I always set up um, my photo shoots for like times that I want to set them up. You know, I'm the boss. So I um, set up my photo shoots for times that's reasonable, that works for me. And um, if you're in school or you work, of course, something like this might be very troublesome. Even working out more than three times a week might be troublesome for you. But this is just something I'm doing. Something I'm, I only made this video to keep you guys updated what's going on with me. And I'm going to pretty much see the difference in me working out more and see if my gains come quicker. Because um, a three-day split, 
when I you know when I look at it like only four chest workouts out of a whole month, I don't know. Seems like baby bull crap to me. Like I say, your muscles don't know what a week is. You know, a week is just a rule of thumb that we just throw out there because it's a week. You know, us as humans, we go by weeks. Um, it ain't like your muscles <clears throat> not go heal before that week. They just say a week. You know, I was working out Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, taking a weekend off. Instead of taking weekends off, I'm doing this to incorporate weekends and stuff like that into my workout. Some people can heal in three or four days, but I'm going to just play it on the safe side and do it every five days. So I'm about to start hopping on this, and um, maybe it makes sense to y'all, maybe it doesn't, but whatever. Till then, y'all stay tuned.